Welcome everyone to your guided meditation to help you with the detoxification process of your emotions. So no part of our body is separate. Everything is connected. So our intention for this meditation is to really to clear our emotional body. Okay, so we can gain this lightness into our mind, into our body to allow us to let go of everything and anything that is not serving us, okay? Because as women, we hold on to emotions in our body, men as well. And women, we will see it oftentimes in our midsection. Also, this can manifest into disease in our um, reproductive organs, right? So let's do this, ladies. Wherever you're at right now, find a comfortable seated or laying down position, whatever works for you, as long as you're comfortable and as long as you're present for this guided meditation. So closing your eyes now, taking three deep breaths and feel free to let out a sigh with each exhale just to really let go of anything that's happened today and also anything that's coming after this meditation. Inhaling and exhaling a deep sigh. Three breaths just like that. I'm going to guide you through the five primary emotional states experiencing them and cleansing each one. So now just breathe normally. So just find a comfortable breath that works for you. The focus here is to engage all the senses and to experience the emotion again in every way before cleansing it. All right, let's begin. So step one, we're going to focus on anger. All right. So start by remembering a time where you were very angry. This may have been recently or years ago. And it is not necessary to like have a mental image of a certain situation at all. Just remember a time where you were very angry. Where were you when this happened? See the space you were in. See the people around you. Did someone say something that triggered you? Was it something you saw? Was it something physical? Take yourself there now. I know this is difficult to do. And know that difficulty is normal. The body forgot this feeling as a way of protecting yourself, but it didn't forget. Your cells didn't forget. You may experience this anger again fully as you now work towards bringing it up and out of you. It's okay if you're angry, this will pass. Feel now your body Feel now how your body felt then, your actual body. How did it feel? What part of your body has feels this right now? Is it your neck, your chest, face? Are your muscles tense? What did the event sound like? What words were exchanged? Was there an incident? Engage all your senses. See and feel now what it was like then. Embody this feeling. Hold it again for another moment. Now over the next three breaths, exhale this frustration. Allow the anger to leave your body out of your nose as you exhale. Exhale. 
leaving out of the nose as you exhale into the ground beneath you, never to return. With each breath, all the sensations dissipate. The vision fades. The muscles relax deeply. Your breath elongates. Breathe several more times and relax. Relax as this anger is leaving your body. Imagine it just coming out of your feet into the ground, never to return again through all of the layers of the earth and being recycled into good energy. Continuing to breathe. Feeling the beauty of the anger leaving your body and feeling lighter already. So next we are going to take a journey into shock. So now focus on your nervous system. When was it so overloaded You couldn't help but gasp at how shocked you were. (laughs) It might have been so much emotion that in that instant you didn't even know what to feel because of the overwhelming buildup of adrenaline within you. This could have happened after a surge of joy or other positive emotions became excessive all at once. Imagine you experiencing the shock once more. See the environment you were in. Were you placed in that space? See who was there or wasn't there to support you. See the event happen again. Feel it. Did your throat feel like it might pop? Did your chest feel inflated? Where else in your body did this happen? What were the sounds? What were the smells and tastes? Did something run through your mind at that time? Bring it all back now in your body, in your mind. This is temporary. Breathe it in to those same parts of your body. You might be afraid to bring out this emotion again. That is normal. Feel these feelings. These feelings are already in you. The trauma is already done. Holding on in holding on to this in the background is where the true Damage lies. Live this shock once more. Hold on to it one last time. Now slowly exhale three times this frightful experience out of your body. Seeing and feeling this breath leave your nose and enter the ground beneath you, creating more space within you than there was a moment ago. See the experiences leave and fade, fade into nothing. Breathe several more times, relax and let go. Letting go is so sweet. 
especially when you weren't even aware you were holding on. Let go. Now for the third step, we're going to focus here on worry. When were you last so obsessed by thought you felt as if you were being consumed? Maybe this is something that happens regularly. It's okay to acknowledge this. Maybe you call it anxiety. Accepting this habit as it is within you will allow it to more easily make its way out of you. So you're no longer hold, holding on. It's no longer sticky. Focus on a particular instance of extreme worry. Where were you? Were you sitting or standing? Feel the shape your body was in at that moment. Did it feel as if your stomach was cramped like a fist? Did your head or chest feel the same way? Did you feel nauseous? Now go over the list of thoughts and concerns in your mind again. Allow these memories to wash over the whole body. Become this emotion fully instead of pushing it back. Let it in right now this feeling of worry. Fill in the rest of your senses to complete the scene. Maybe there was so much welling up inside you that you don't even, even remember what the rest of you felt like. That's okay. Just try to imagine this difficult time. Bring it fully into your conscious mind. Breathe and hold it there. Now, release it with three deep breaths, exhaling all that worry and pensiveness out of your nose and into the ground. See this massive wave of concern leave your body, leaving your body and your mind fading with each breath. Breathe smoothly a few more times enjoying 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 this renewed sense of relief and peace worry only pretends to be necessary it no longer controls you So the fourth step here, we're going to move into grief. So now remember a time when you were most sad. Remember the way it started within you. Maybe it started with a word, with a sight, or something deeper inside. Go there now. Remember who was with you and what was around you. Feel the immense down bearing of emotion well up in your chest and the rest of your body. Where were you? Were you alone or being embraced? Was your posture sunken over, caving in your chest with your head hanging to the ground? Without moving your body, see and feel that bodily position and how this sadness contracted and fell inside you. Feel now how your face felt. Were there tears? What did they feel like on your face? Did you find an amount of tension holding you back from replaying this experience? That's okay, that's really normal and natural. Allow this tension to strip away and go deep into this feeling. 
These emotions are part of you and so much so that they don't easily want to give up their hiding place. Bring it to the surface now. Did your mouth water? Did you have a big gulp in your throat? Remember each sense now. If you tear up or cry now, that is also normal. That's also really healthy and beautiful. You don't need to hold on to this anymore. See and feel this completely. This feeling will bubble forth and leave. Continue breathing. Now exhale this grief. See the feelings of loss and its sensations leave your body. Breathe in and out two more times. With each exhale, breathe in, breathe these memories out of your nose and into the ground, releasing them forever. Breathe slow and smooth several more times as you come back to the center of you, cleansed that much more. You are so much lighter and clearer than when you started. We have one last step to go. But before we do, just quietly thank yourself for showing up for this. This wasn't easy. So now finally bring your body to a time when you were afraid. Maybe this was a time you received bad news. Something scary may have happened to you. Maybe something in the future scares you. Whatever it is, think it and feel it. Accept this motion as part of you, surfing it into your conscious mind. Remember now where you were when you were experiencing this fear. Allow it to wash over, wash over, over you. Don't be afraid. This may be the hardest one yet for some of you. Did it live in your body, in your belly, in your back, your legs? Experience those feelings again now. Bring in the fear out from its hiding place within you. Engage all your senses, your mind, your body. See and feel this fearful experience once again. giving yourself permission to experience all of this often scary, you know, reality that happened, experiencing it one more time. You may notice that the expectations you have about surfacing these emotions melts away now because you're permitting yourself to move through them. Experience them one more time. Breathe and live this fear one last time. Breathe out, letting go of this scared experience and all of the sensations. Repeating two more breaths, allowing the layers of fear to dissipate, exhaling from your nose. Out your body, the fear goes and into the ground beneath you. Take several more breaths, focusing on making your breath, your breathing slow, smooth, even and deep.
as the session comes to an end, you may feel lighter. You may also feel tired. It's now time to restore your energy in your body center. Place your left palm over your lower belly, a few inches below your belly button. Place your right palm on top of your left hand, moving the hands together in a circular fashion on your abdomen, going clockwise from small circles to bigger and bigger circles. Keep going, making those circles. Keep going. Circles are moving clockwise. They started at small circles and they're getting bigger and bigger. A few more times. Next, rub your hands together to create warmth. So rub them together until your hands get warm. Faster, faster, create that friction. Warm up those hands, really warm. Faster, faster. Now place the palms of your hands over your eyes to allow the energy and warmth to transfer. Now gently just begin to massage your face. Massage your forehead, your temples. Just giving yourself a gentle massage. Rub your ears, your earlobes. Massage around your jaw, your neck. Move your neck side to side and slowly open your eyes. Looking around you, feeling so grateful for the time that you just spent dedicating to yourself. How beautiful was that? You honored yourself in such a profound way. Thank you for being here with me for this emotional detoxification. It's been my pleasure to be here with you.